Praise the Lord, this is Dr. C. Dexter Wise III and welcome back to another edition of the video version of Every Day with Dr. Wise where you get a mighty message in about three minutes or less. We are in a series entitled Trick or Trick based on Genesis chapter 3 and we're talking about various tricks of the devil that we see highlighted and lifted from this seminal chapter. We've already talked about many tricks and we've got another one today and that is he leaves you hanging when the damage is done. He leaves you hanging when the damage is done. Okay, look at those first several verses of Genesis chapter 3. He comes to Eve. He makes a suggestion that uh, if she eats of the fruit, she will not die. He says to her that God lied to her, that uh, he's just saying that to keep them from getting something good. And so finally, Eve eats of the fruit. She gives it to her husband. They both die, or at least their eyes are open, and death becomes a possibility, and he disappears. Whatever happened to him, he just disappears. Once they eat of the fruit he disappears why does he do that he leaves you hanging once he knows he's got you on automatic pilot once he knows that he's got you addicted he's got you in a habit he's got you hooked that he no longer has to be there to prompt you to do it then he leaves you hanging then he leaves you hanging when he realizes that you are going to do his bidding you're going to do his work for him and so why should he have to hang around to talk to Adam if Eve is going to do it for him so not only was Adam and Eve or were Adam and Eve hooked on automatic pilot but Eve had gotten to the place where now she would do his work for him and then finally he hangs around long enough to know that he's got us separated from God. As soon as he knows that he has cut that relationship, as soon as he knows that he has ruptured that fellowship, then he disappears. And so, whenever the adversary wants to hang around you, don't hang around him, because after the deal is done, he's gonna disappear. That's a trick of the devil. Don't you dare fall for that trick. Trust God.